Who's got the crown, the flea or the king? Hi everyone, let's explore the fascinating realm of football fortune today. We are contrasting Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo, two titans and legends. But this time, our objective is to maximize our net worth rather than focus on goals or awards. We're squaring the numbers to determine who wins the battle of the financial accounts, from lavish endorsements to enormous wages. So, Ronaldo or Messi? Legends in soccer, Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo are both nearing the twilight of their careers. Messi is a major league soccer player for Inter Miami, whereas Ronaldo is currently a Saudi Arabian football player for Al Nasser. Financial stability is guaranteed by Ronaldo's large wage at Al Nasser, even with the team playing in a less competitive league. However, his riches predates his playing career. He owns his own companies and has huge sponsorship deals, making him a global name. Similar to Ronaldo, Messi has a huge bankroll. He can fetch a hefty wage even in the American League according to his talent. But like Ronaldo, he has large sponsorship deals that contribute to his income. During their careers, both players have amassed substantial wealth as well as on the playing field. On February 5th, 1985, Cristiano Ronaldo dos Santos Aveiro was born in Madeira, Portugal. His parents were a gardener and cook, and he also held a part-time position as the equipment manager for a nearby soccer team. Ronaldo was signed as a youth player by Sporting Lisbon after his early talent was seen at the age of 12. When it was discovered that he had a racing heart and needed surgery, his trip took a turn for the worst. Ronaldo resumed training following the treatment, demonstrating his tenacity and resolve even at an early age. Conversely, Lionel Messi, who was born in Rosario, Argentina on June 24, 1987, was raised in a close-knit household with two elder brothers and a sister. His early soccer interest was encouraged by his parents, Jorge Horacio Messi and Celia Maria Cucitini. Messi played for Newell's Old Boys and joined the Rosario Soccer Club at the age of six. Messi's growth hormone shortage was discovered at age eight, but his father was unable to pay for treatment. Carlos Rexac of FC Barcelona volunteered to pay for Messi's relocation to Spain. Messi signed a contract on a napkin with his father's approval and the family moved in 2001. Messi experienced homesickness at first, but he excelled in Barcelona's football program and joined the team known as the Baby Dream Team. Cristiano Ronaldo joined the first team of Sporting Lisbon at the age of 17. Alex Ferguson, the manager of Manchester United, noticed his skill and signed him in 2003. Ronaldo wanted to leave in 2006 to 2007, but he stayed and got better helping Manchester United win the Premier League and scoring over 20 goals. He won the Champions League and set a new club record the following season with 42 goals. After that, Ronaldo paid a record sum to join his childhood team, Real Madrid. He ended his rookie season with 33 goals after having a fantastic start, scoring in his first four games. In the years that followed, he surpassed his own records by scoring more than 40 and eventually 60 goals. In 2013, he also took home the Ballon d'Or. Ronaldo moved to Juventus in 2018 after leaving Real Madrid, where he finished his rookie year with 21 goals. In addition, he has achieved success playing soccer internationally, leading Portugal to victory in the 2016 Euro Cup. In 2021, Ronaldo went back to Manchester United, and in 2023, he joined Al Nasser. Lionel Messi became the third youngest player in FC Barcelona history when he made his debut against RCD Espanyol at the age of 17 and began receiving compensation as a member of the first squad. After he and Ronaldinho scored in a match, he was given a standing ovation. Messi has accomplished a lot in his career. In 2006, he became the youngest player and scorer from Argentina in a FIFA World Cup. Messi has received multiple honors, like as an Olympic gold medal from the 2008 Summer Olympics and four Ballon d'Or trophies. Argentina defeated France in the 2022 World Cup final thanks to two goals from Messi in an exciting game. His on-field accomplishments have solidified his place among the all-time great soccer players. In addition to his soccer pay, Cristiano Ronaldo earns around $60 million a year from sponsorship deals. Nike is reportedly offering one of Ronaldo's most expensive endorsement deals, a $1 billion lifetime contract with a $100 million signing bonus to the player. In addition, he sells apparel and perfumes under his own brand. 
Ronaldo signed a four-year contract worth $64 million a year to join Juventus in 2018. Because to his achievements on the field and his multiple endorsement deals, Ronaldo has been one of the highest-paid athletes in the world for the entirety of his career. Some of the most lucrative contracts in soccer history have been awarded to Lionel Messi. In 2017, he inked a deal with Barcelona that included a basic salary of $168 million per year. Messi signed a two-year contract worth $74 million annually before taxes, or about $40 million after taxes, when he left Barcelona to join Paris Saint-Germain in 2021. Messi has a lifetime contract with Adidas and makes an additional $40 million a year from endorsements. In 2023, there were rumors that Messi was on the verge of agreeing to a $1 billion contract with an unidentified Saudi Pro League team. Furthermore, he planned to sign a four-year contract with Inter Miami of the Major League Soccer, MLS, at a salary of $1.3 million per week. Messi has agreed to an annual vacation and social media responsibilities as part of a $25 million deal to promote tourism in Saudi Arabia. Cristiano Ronaldo is a father of five kids. After five years, his relationship with Russian model Irina Sheikh came to an end in January 2015. At the moment, he is dating Spanish model Georgina Rodriguez. Ronaldo is well known for his altruistic deeds. He received the title of most philanthropic sportsman in the world in 2015, having contributed more than $6 million to the relief efforts following the earthquake in Nepal. After his family relocated to Saudi Arabia in 2023, Ronaldo put his Manchester estate up for sale, asking $6.66 million. They first resided at a towering hotel in Riyadh until settling into a long-term residence. Since 2008, Lionel Messi has been in a relationship with fellow Rosario native Antonella Rocuzzo. Thiago, Matero and Chiro are their three children. They were wed in June 2007. Messi has a tattoo of his mother's face on his left shoulder, and he is very close to his immediate family. The amount of money Cristiano Ronaldo is worth is $600 million. He is among the highest paid athletes in the world because a significant portion of his revenue comes from endorsements and compensation. He made over $120 million in 2020, of which roughly $70 million came from his salary, and the remaining $50 million from endorsement deals with brands like Nike, Herbalife, and Clear Shampoo. It is anticipated that Cristiano Ronaldo would have made over a billion dollars during his career by the time he quits, a record no other football player has attained. Lionel Messi is one wealthy man. He is renowned for his time spent playing for the Argentina national team and FC Barcelona and is regarded as one of the greatest soccer players in history. Messi's total earnings from salary and endorsements have surpassed $1.3 billion, with roughly $900 million coming from salary and $400 million from sponsorships. Despite some stories falsely calling him a millionaire, in the end, selecting a winner just on the basis of wealth may fail to fully recognize the impact that each player has had on the game and their legacy. Their respective careers have left a lasting impression on soccer history, and Ronaldo and Messi's wealth is only one facet of their extraordinary achievements. So, who's your favorite athlete among those two? Feel free to comment down below. Also, make sure you like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for your watching.